Hey everybody, I'm back again, my trusty clonopin, but this time uh, I'm going to try fireball instead of crown, so And we'll get on with the review. That's some pretty good stuff. Second one of the day, by the way. Anyway, the movie I'm going to review today. 1975 classic um, Picnic at Hanging Rock it was directed by Peter Weir back in 1975 this is a Criterion Blu-ray DVD combo I think it's three discs it's in 1.78 to 1 ratio I've had this movie for quite a while. I've seen it several times. It is a really good movie. Um, it's about these girls at a girl's school that go on a picnic at Hanging Rock. That's a side. It's actually Criterion 29. This is a fairly new release. I think it came out maybe a couple years ago. Not 100% sure, but it was originally released by Criterion a long time ago on DVD, but it was non-anamorphic, and it didn't have nowhere near the bonus features that this has. First, I'll pull the discs out of here, but these girls, they go for a picnic at this place called Hanging Rock. I believe this movie was filmed in New Zealand or Australia or something like that. And um, several of them didn't return. There's no real explanation as to what happened to them. Some of them eventually do come back to the school, but some of them you never do find out what happens. But other than that, the movie is a really good movie. But you don't ever know, did the girls die? Did they just disappear? Did aliens take them? What happened? But inside here you've got a little booklet. Very pretty women in this movie, by the way. Um, but yeah, it's just, just mostly writing their pictures here and there, pictures of the girls at school, and everybody was going into a panic about where the girls could be, why they didn't come back. Whatever, I mean, they searched for the girls, but they never could find them. So they have no idea what happened to them, and it's still a mystery at the end of the movie. So that's a little bit of a spoiler. Don't look for any real answers here. That's the Blu-ray disc. And there are two DVDs. That's disc one of the DVD. And disc two, the DVD. Criterion does an excellent job with their releases. But here's the background, what was underneath the discs. That is, I assume, hanging rock. Some of the foliage and stuff. But 
<coughs> I believe they go back up into these hills here that are rock and some of them just don't return. And like I said, there's never any explanation as to what happened to some of them, why they disappeared or anything. Um, but the movie takes place at like turn of the century. Well, turn of last century, around 1900. And, um, yeah, that's really pretty much the plot of the movie. I think one of the girls gets in trouble and she's not allowed to go with the other girls to Hanging Rock. And, um, it's probably a good thing for her because she didn't disappear like some of the others did. And also in this package is the novel in which the movie is based on. If I could still read, I um, might even be tempted to read this to see if it fleshes out the story a little more. Um, it's from Penguin Books. It was like it was written by Joan Lindsay. But that's a neat addition. Criterion does some wonderful work. Um, apart from that, let's see what kind of bonus features are. Remastered in high definition, supervised by director Peter Weir with 5.1 surround DTS HD master on the Blu-ray. Extended interview with Weir. A new piece on the making of the film featuring interviews from 2003. Um, and producer Hal McElroy and Jim McElroy. I guess they're probably brothers and some cast members. Um, there's a new introduction by film scholar David Thompson. Um, Recollection, Hanging Rock, 1900, from 1975. It's an on-the-set documentary hosted by um, Lavelle and features interviews with Weir and the actors of... It has an award-winning short film called Homedale from 1971. It's a black comedy by Peter Weir, trailer. It has one Blu-ray and two DVDs. All contents available in both formats. The bonus booklet that I showed you plus the novel that the movie is based on and as I said this is a very good movie I would highly recommend it picnic at hanging rock but it's all I have at this point I don't know whether you would consider this horror or if you would consider it drama suspense mystery it's definitely a mystery because you never do find out what happened to the girls they just disappeared. Don't look for any answers in this movie because there's not any. But it is a very good movie. Until next time, this is Clonopin and Crown signing off.